Hello, Auburn and Large City School District. In order to annotate over your desktop, do the following steps. On your active panel Promethean Board home screen, you have an icon called Class Flow. You can either start by clicking this icon or from your laptop, you can just look up the Class Flow website and then from there you're going to create an account. So you'll click on login or create an account, in my case it's login. Once in class flow, you'll be given the option if you scroll down to download class flow desktop. You can press download not on your Promethean board but from your laptop is where you're actually going to need to do this part. Um, you can download Classflow Desktop and then in order to install it, the district's going to have to approve it with an administrator password. Once you have the district install it for you, here's how you can annotate over the desktop. With your computer hooked up to the Promethean Active Panel, you'll click on HDMI in like usual. Sorry for the messy desktop with all my icons. When you go to HDMI in, you'll be in your laptop and from there you'll just locate your class flow desktop icon. You're going to want to launch that. You can activate your class flow desktop icon and then you will get three bars for a menu in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. That is the ClassFlow app that you're going to use in the, in the web browser. So once you've opened up ClassFlow desktop, then you can go to the web like you normally would. And once in the web, you can click on this menu button and you'll get a few options. You can experiment to figure out what all the options are, but the desktop annotate is this button right here. When you click on that, it opens up a special bar for you, and these are tools that you can use on the, the browser while you search. So for example, if I click on the pen, I can now write right on the web browser. Um, and you'll notice I can't interact with the internet browser when I'm using the desktop annotation features. In order to get out of this mode, um, you can erase what you've done, or or you can click on the desktop annotate feature again and it's going to bring you back to the, the web browser. So if you were to go to a new workbook page, you would then just reactivate desktop annotation. You'll get this bar again and now you basically turn the internet into a whiteboard. Again, to go back, you just re-click desktop annotation and it's going to take you out of the whiteboard. I hope this feature helps you. Uh, good luck.